Holy crap. <laughs> Gotta go again. What's going on guys? So obviously I am back in my car. I have my keys right here. We are about to do the first startup since I got my car back. I like the way that sounds. What you got in mind? I'm going to cruise around a little bit. I'm not going to get into it too much. Right now I am just on a base map. Uh, when Junior's back in town, um, I'm going to get it on a dyno, get a pro tune. So everything is good to go. But right now I'm just on a base map. So I'm not going to hammer it too hard. But uh, I, I'm going to go for a drive and I'm going to enjoy it a little bit. So here we go. Ready for this. Sounds about the same. It might be a little bit louder because I have a catless exhaust. And uh, I really don't notice a difference. But we'll see if that changes whenever I get on it. definitely a little bit louder <laughs> so I think the first thing I'm going to do is when I go home I'm gonna drop off all these parts that are in my car right now they're the old parts they will be listed on throttle.com I need to sell them uh, most of them are in great shape I just am upgrading so I'm not using them anymore so I'm gonna drop that stuff off and then we can cruise around a little bit more Holy crap. <laughs> Gotta go again. <laughs> that is so loud. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> wow, you guys. Holy crap. Okay, so I did go with an external wastegate and I knew it was gonna be louder. <laughs> but this is just crazy, that's awesome. I absolutely love it. First time driving his car and all I've had to go on was videos on YouTube which don't do it justice. But holy crap, I, I'm just speechless. I have nothing to say about it. It's just, <laughs> wow. But giggle. I feel like Matt Moran doing a car review right now because I just can't help but giggle. It's hilarious how loud it is, but it sounds so good. It sounds so, so good. Oh man. You ready for this? Because I'm ready for this. Windows down. Second gear. Traffic. There's going to be more of that later. <laughs> it's so hard not to get into throttle too much. It's just right there begging me to get into it. to say about it I'm just speechless it's hilarious it's absolutely hilarious so loud but it sounds so so good I also love that you really don't know that it's there until you get into the throttle so if I'm just driving around yeah I have a loud Subaru it's whatever but it's when you actually hammer the throttle that that gate opens up and it's just stupid loud for no reason and I love it speechless right now <laughs> okay 
external wastegate is probably the best mod ever. Oh man. This is like a mod that truly transforms your car, even more than going with a bigger turbo or bigger injectors or something like that. This is just something that, uh, it's basically like getting a new car in my opinion. This, this reminds me of when I first got my STI and I was blown away by how awesome it was. I feel, I feel very much the same way right now with ex external wastegate on it. The best part is nobody knows nobody has a clue until you actually floor it and you get on it that's the best part about this thing i love it okay quick thoughts about my exhaust upgrades right now so i did upgrade to a catless downpipe i was worried that you would smell a whole lot of exhaust in the car but you really don't um, I've been in cars where you smell exhaust and that was one of the reasons I didn't want to go with Catless initially. Um, but I have the NVIDIA downpipe and I don't, I don't really smell exhaust. You get like a little bit of a hint of it, but it's really not bad at all. And second is the external wastegate. Obviously it's loud, but it is only loud when I'm in it in full throttle, full boost. Other than that, you really don't hear it and you wouldn't even know that it's installed on the car. So if you are concerned about external wastegates being too loud, just know that it's only gonna open up and be loud whenever you're on it. You also have the option to reroute that external wastegate back into the downpipe if you choose, um, but it's totally up to you. <laughs> oh man I've said this a hundred times already but I'm just speechless there's really nothing that you could say about this it's just something that you have to enjoy and experience I'm sure this video and the audio is not doing it justice at all it's something that you have to hear or experience in person Never gets old. Never gets old. Okay, windows are up so we could actually have a semi-civilized conversation here. Uh, one of the things that I love about the external wastegate is, okay, my car's already loud, right? So whenever I'm pulling out somewhere, yeah, my car, my car is loud and obnoxious. But hold on just a moment, my car can get even louder and even more obnoxious. And that is just hilarious to me. Right now, I am that guy who's being a pain in the ass to everybody and is just being that loud, obnoxious car guy. That's me right now, and I'm loving it, and I really don't care if people don't like it because I love it, it's my car, and I think it's hilarious. So I wanted to keep this video short and sweet and keep it as primarily my reaction to my external wastegate uh, as well as getting my car back. But to give you a quick heads up on what you can expect to see with this car, uh, all the decals that are on my windows are old and faded and outdated, so those will be coming off. I will be cleaning up my car and vinyl wrapping it. Uh, that should take care of the paint issue, at least um, at least short term. I need to re-powder coat my Brembos. I'm most likely gonna have a shop do it just because I wanna see what their results are compared to mine. Uh, as I said in a previous video, they are mostly fading because the clear coat that I used uh, is not UV stable and I knew that, I didn't care. Uh, but I did have some cracking in my finish and I'm not sure why, so I'd rather just have professionals take care of it this time around. Uh, and I think that's about it. Uh, the interior of my car does need detailed because it hasn't been cleaned in like two years, sorry. Um, but as far as this car goes, there's gonna be a lot of TLC going on and you know, just updating things, cleaning things, uh, repairing my front bumper and stuff like that. So as far as parts installs go, there's no other major parts coming right now unless I hit the lottery or something and come into like a huge amount of money. But it's gonna be a lot of TLC cleaning, uh, updating, things like that. So I'm sure a lot of you guys are gonna be looking forward to that. As always, I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll catch you guys next time.